We are students from Ritsunei Kamoriyama High School from Japan and Jonjin High School from Taiwan. I have a question. For these four pictures, who do you think is the more easy school principal? According to the Ministry of Health in Japan, it is said that there are more men in management, management positions. It said also, it, it occurred to uh, me that this might be applied to our school. Also, I have an idea, I, I have an image of school, school in, uh, sorry, uh, in school, sorry, in school assembly, mom speak in front of anyone. According to our social studies teachers, those examples are called hidden kaijira. It is a kind of a knowledge, behavior, and awareness that is not part of the former school curriculum, but is an additionally taught by teachers or teachers and students. So, so we asked question, so we asked students at both of our schools the same question. To our surprise, over ninety percent of over ninety percent of and our response is to the image of a man as their image of a principal. Three issues can be seen in the result of this survey. First, it is difficult for women's opinions to be reflected when all managers are men. Second, it's become more difficult for women to become managers because of the state Stereotype the managers are men. Third, schools should have a diversity in the leadership that reflect the diversity of students. We think third in particular is the most serious problem in today's global society. So what about Taiwan? In our school, both male and female teachers speak at old school assemblies. Rizumaka Moriyama High School has fewer female teachers. Zhongzhan High School has many female teachers. In Zhongzhan High School, the ratio of male and female administrators was almost half and half. However, in a school assembly speech survey, most respondents indicated that their image of a principal was male, a result similar to that of Rizumaka Moriyama. To research this problem more deeply, our team did some research in different ways. First, the Rhythmaker Moriam site made an organization chart of visualization. You can see that third. Actually, this year, 100% of our school's manager, managers are all the men. In, our, in other words, the, the reality matches to our uh, survey. Yes, thank you. Zhongzhan High School did the same survey and got over 200 responses. Also, we did an interview with our school's principal to ask about our teacher's working environment. From our research, we planned three approaches to solve the problem. First, we made a video to educate people about this problem, and here's the QR code. Second, we made a poster, and this will be posted to our school and on social networking sites. And two of our members have already posted that on their social media, talking about this problem, and they got over 400 views. Lastly, we will present this problem to school leaders, including our principal and other school officials. So, Japan is known as a country that gender equality is not well developed. According to our research, Japanese students have a big image that principal is always male. How about Taiwan? Taiwan is known as a country with high level of gender equality. Our survey revealed that, unlike Japanese side, half of our school's leaders are female. If, however, we also found that most of our Taiwanese high school students have most of our Taiwanese students have the stereotypes 
for example, it's like the principal is male. Yeah, it's hard to reflect on our school's hidden curriculum, and that, and we want to work together to remove the unconscious remaining and resolve conflict. So and our team is going to work together, and we are going to only not only work for the World Young Meeting, but also we will do other actions like delivering our opinions to government agencies. And so. Let's work together to make a better world for our future generations. Thank you very much.